creating a normal distribution curve from a series of values and numbers for Mac OS. Here is a numbers document with a column of values. In this example, they can be a bunch of test scores. We are going to create a normal distribution curve based on these scores, using tools available in numbers as well as an Apple script I have written, which you can download to use. Here is the Apple script. You can download it from the link below. I have this in an automator service on my Mac for easy access, but you can also run it from script editor. This is, in practice, a better habit, so that you can verify what is in a script before running it. First, select your series of values. They can be in rows or columns, as long as they are contiguous. Next, go to the Apple script and click on the Run button. You will notice that a new table is created automatically, and a lot of actions and formulae needed to make a normal distribution curve is created for you automatically. You will notice that in this new table, the Apple script has automatically calculated the mean, standard deviation, minimum and maximum values for you. The 25%. 50% and 75% quartiles are derived for you too. In the right column, you can see the standard deviation values, which are derived from the column on the left. Let us now create the distribution curve. Select the middle and right columns, taking care to include only the values, not the titles on the top row. With that done, go to the menu bar, click on Insert, Chart, and 2D Scatter. Let's format the chart to make it better. From the Format button on the top right, click on the third tab view, Series. I usually change the data symbol and add a connection line to start. You should of course experiment with the many formatting options available here. There you have it. From a range of values, an Apple script to parse your data into a new table that numbers can use to create a normal distribution curve easily. Hope this helps.